Hey, you guys. So I'm back with another message from the Lord. This particular message is about a portion of a dream. Um, it's a two-part message. I'm going to put the other one in another separate video. Um, however, um, this message, um, or, or based upon this dream that I had last night, um, I was with a person, um, and we were like going somewhere and we were like we were just traveling on our way somewhere um and we were out in nature and the person i was traveling with his name was timothy right and so i was traveling with timothy and we were on it was like we were on our mission we was on our journey and we had ran into some people and they were just like, they had drones and they were out like recording, doing videos. And one particular person, one of them had a dog with them. And so um, they didn't have their dog on a leash or anything like that. And the dog came charging after, you know, me and Timothy. And Timothy went and tried to cover me and protect me from getting bit by the dog however i was like yelling telling the people you know get your dog get your dog get your dog um i was really standing firm um and i even had to strike the dog um before the dog could attack us i struck i struck the dog with something and the dog like ran ran off and i didn't see the dog no more um and I was just like, God, what are you trying to say? Like, what's why am I having this dream? Um, God told me to go read about Timothy. You know, Timothy, he genuinely cared about other people's welf welfare, and he was a man of God. Um, and, um, you know, he loved to share and preach about the gospel and the good news. How, uh, however, uh, one of Timothy's biggest struggle was he was very timid. And God is saying in this season, in this hour, you can't be timid. You're going to have to be able to stand on God's word in this season, in this hour. Um, you can't be timid. All right. Um, and even after I had struck, um, strike the dog and the dog ran away, like the people was recording it. Like I said, filming it, thinking it was funny, saying that they were going to use it um, in a part of their movie or whatever. And I had to tell them, like, I didn't consent to be in your movie. Like, if you do use this footage, um, if you do use this footage without my consent, y'all will be hearing from my lawyer. So just being able to stand up and stand up for what is right. And I was telling them, like, I could sue y'all for not containing your dog, for your dog trying to attack us. Like, I was just giving out law. You have to, you can't be timid in this season, in this hour. You are going to have to really be bold in this hour, okay? No timidness. You can't be timid, all right? Even though, you know, Timothy had a good heart, he was trying to shield me, he was trying to protect me, but there comes a time where you have to stand up and you have to fight back. And God is saying, um, you can't be timid in this hour. You're going to have to stand on his word. You're going to have to fight back. And you're going to have to fight back with his word. Um, when I was giving them law, the law meant the word of God. The law meant the Bible. Okay. And um, I stood firm on that. Okay. So this is a quick message. But this is not the season to be timid. You can't be timid in this hour. You're going to have to stand up and stand on God's word. Um and you're going to have to be willing to, you know, stand on and preach the gospel. You can't be timid. Um, when it comes time for you to give correction, you're going to have to give correction. And that was another thing that Timothy struggled with um, in the Bible. Like when it came time for him to correct certain people, he couldn't. He struggled with timid, being timid and not being able to correct the people. It's, we can't do that in this season, this hour. Because um, deliverance has to come forth and people have to be set free so you're going to have to be able to stand strong stand firm and not be timid all right okay so i love you guys i hope you all have an amazing day and i will chat with you all later